Whether reducing the weight of existing designs or quickly generating new designs, topology studies, which were introduced in SOLIDWORKS 2018, allow us to quickly optimize our parts based on user-defined goals and constraints. And now in 2019, we can add frequency, stress, and factor of safety constraints as we optimize our designs. Like so many of our designs, the weight of this assembly is critical. So I want to design this yellow bracket with the greatest stiffness to weight ratio possible while ensuring frequency response doesn't become an issue because this wheel here is spinning at about 9,000 RPM or 150 Hertz. So I want to ensure the fundamental frequency of this bracket is not less than 150 Hertz so I don't want to run into any resonance or, or vibration issues. I'll create a new topology study and select this bracket which has been designed to use the maximum design space. I add my materials, fixtures, and loads just as I would in any other study and then I'm ready to add my goals and constraints. I can choose to either minimize the mass, minimize the maximum displacement, or create the best stiffness to weight ratio. I'll choose that and then I want to reduce my weight of this part by 70%. Here you can see the new options in 2019 to add a frequency control. I want the first mode of vibration to be greater than 150 Hertz. You can also right click here to insert new rows to add more frequency constraints. So that way I can either include specific frequency regions or exclude frequency ranges. I can also apply a stress constraint or a factor safety constraint. Now I'm ready to add my manufacturing controls. I can choose to preserve regions. Those are areas where material isn't going to be removed uh, from my bracket during the study. I can even specify demold direction. So here I can choose a mid-plane direction, a pole direction, or even a stamping direction. This is going to give me results that are more producible using traditional manufacturing processes like casting, machining, injection molding, or stamping. I'm going to specify uh, symmetry about this plane so that the right half of my part will look identical to the left half. And I'm also going to specify a thickness control so that my minimum wall thickness is 20 millimeters. Now I'm ready to run the study. The solving of a topology study is an iterative process and now in 2019 we can stop the analysis uh, before the final iteration completes so we can view and save intermediate results. Our results are this material mass plot and as you can see all the elements that aren't contributing to the stiffness of the part have been re removed uh, giving us the bracket with the greatest stiffness to weight ratio possible. I also get this smooth mesh plot which I can export as either a new configuration or a new part. And in 2019, I can save it as a solid body for easier use in downstream design processes. Topology studies increase the power we have to optimize our designs, especially when it comes to reducing weight. And in 2019, finding the ideal shape to meet your design requirements is easier and faster than ever.